Also making news this evening, first came the accusations of sexual harassment in state government. But today, one accuser put a face on the problem, accusing state Senator Ira Silverstein of inappropriate behavior that led to her personal crisis. Roseanne Tejas has more on the allegations and legislative efforts to combat sexual harassment in government. I ended up six weeks in a crisis. I lost 20 pounds. My hair fell out. Denise Rothheimer told a House committee hearing today that Illinois Senator Ira Silverstein offered support for a bill she drafted to help crime victims, but the support came at a price. He used it as a means, like a carrot, where he had power over me. And he would uh, have meetings with me because he liked to look at me. He thought I was pretty. He would um, Facebook message me constantly. I have 400 pages of Facebooks from him. He even killed my bill in April because he thought I had a boyfriend. Mind you, this is a married man. Senator Silverstein told me on the phone, I apologize if I made her uncomfortable, but I will let the commission do its job. I don't want to try this in the press. I asked, do you feel you did anything inappropriate? Silverstein said no. The accusations naming a lawmaker came as the committee passed legislation that includes sexual harassment training and policies and authorizes investigations. What would you say to legislators who up until now seem to have think that, you know, seem to have thought they could get away with this kind of behavior? What do you say directly to them? Um, better knock it off because you're going to get in big trouble. As for the allegations against Silverstein, Senate President John Cullerton's office confirms reporting them to the Ethics Commission, where an investigation is believed to be ongoing, Robin Erica. Does Rothheimer have confidence in this investigation, considering who's conducting it? She is concerned that if legislators have a part in investigating, they would have a conflict of interest, and so she would like to see an independent body of some sort. An ethics uh, commission is now being formed, a task force to look into that. All right. Thanks, Roseanne.